so it's New Year's Eve, um, it's 5.43 and um, there's a train in 20 minutes that I'm going to try and get at 5 past 6. Um, I've had about 20 minutes sleep because I took, I took some nighttime cold and flu tablets to help with my period pain to help me sleep. But I think I took them too early because then I fell asleep for like 20 minutes then woke up and was awake all night. So not good, not ideal. So I'm gonna try and sleep on the train. So yeah, I'm gonna try and get the five past six train that gets me at half past seven, and then I can walk because apparently walking's good for your egg freezingness. So then I can walk from Victoria to Harley Street. So yeah, I'll see you there. <laughs> So I missed that five past six train because my car was frozen solid. Um, but it's okay because it's so cold out there that I don't actually want to walk anywhere today. So I'll just get a cab. Um, so I'm just having some breakfast. Now I'm doing veganuary for Monday. Um, and my nutritionist was like, okay, so before you do veganuary, you need to get as much calcium as you can. So I've got 100% fat uh, Greek yogurt with fruit. And then I'm having some toasted peanut butter as well. Um, to get me through the day because then hopefully I won't have to eat anything in London. I can just go in, do my scan and then go home again. <laughs> So I'm here, I'm in the waiting room, just waiting for my scanner. I'm a bit early for the first time in my life. Uh, never ever early for anything, but I'm early today. So yeah, I'm just here in the waiting room. Some nice pictures and stuff. Um, but yeah, just waiting to be scanned. So there's nobody else in here. I've just been in for my scan and um, I couldn't obviously film in there whilst I've got my legs kimbo and my ovaries are being videoed. Um, so I've got nine follicles on one side and ten follicles on the other side, which is good. It's like good for egg production. Um, the only thing is my uterus lining is a bit thick, but because I'm on day one of my cycle, um, it might be okay, so I might still be able to proceed. Um, so I'm just waiting to go and see the nurse now, and then we're going to go through my medication. And yeah, just what happens next, really. So I've just got home from my first appointment in London. So just have a little rundown of what happened. So I went up to London this morning, very, very early, but I'm back before 11 o'clock, so fabulous. Um, so I went in for my scan, first of all, and they did an internal scan, which is really weird, you can see it on the screen. But I thought like, you know, I do TV stuff and do stuff on Instagram for a living, this woman, I'm looking at the screen and I'm like, cannot see anything. And she's like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five. Like, amazing. Um, so she measured everything. I had nine follicles on my left and ten follicles on my right, which my friends who have had IVF tell me is very good. Um, I'm not having IVF, obviously, though. Um, and then she, me she measured the lining of my uterus. Um, which is obviously what you get rid of when you're on your period um, and it was six and a half they like it to be five and under but because I'm technically on day one but because I had to go in um, because obviously they're closed tomorrow because it's New Year's Day and then it's Saturday so um, they were like yeah that's absolutely fine we'll still proceed so then I had to go back into the waiting room and then wait and then I'm going to see the nurse or the midwife um, and she went through everything with me. So I'm starting my injections on Saturday. I have my pen injection um, every day until next Thursday. One one in a, one injection a day um, between six and nine o'clock in the evening. Um, around the same time every day, in your tummy. Um, very easy to use apparently. Just make sure you get the dosage right. So I'm having two, two, five. Um, and then on Thursday, I'm going back in for another scan at 8.50 in the morning. So slight lay-in for me, but hopefully I'll be back in a better sleep schedule by then with my new vegan lifestyle. Um, so yeah, so I'm a little bit sore. Like sitting on the train, I was a bit like, oh, I'm so glad I didn't drive. I was gonna drive to London, which would be like two hours. So I would not have been home yet. Um, but I'm so glad I didn't drive because yeah, sitting on the train, because they move like, she was like, oh, that's just your bowel moving. And, like, this is her with the wand, obviously. It's got a big camera on the end. 
she's like that's your belt oh, that's your bladder moving so everything's been like jumbled around like my ovaries have been poked so i'm a bit like oh so i'm gonna have a hot water bottle and uh watch some more real housewives of salt lake city my new favorite thing um i asked her and she said i could drink tonight which is fabulous um but i'm not gonna go crazy but yes i start on saturday so i'm a bit dubious a bit nervous but we'll see we'll see